Hello everyone, welcome to Aspire. We have a new updated website, thestudygenie.com, and we have everything available on that. So I will be showing you how to register yourself, and then after that, how to book yourself into a particular course that is suitable for you based on your exam date. So firstly, I'm already logged in here. However, if you've not logged in, then you need to register yourself with your name and your email address. Thereafter, as you can see here, you may have your initials or some sort of a letter based on your name. Once you click on that, you have to go on to My Learnings or wish list or dashboard or account settings and purchase history. So at this moment in time, what we'll do is we'll go on dashboard because that will show us what we have in our account. So now, as you can see, there are the courses which uh, are available, which you can see on the top where you, when you click on see all. Additionally, if you are already enrolled in any course, then you can um, it will show you there and it will also use, show you the expiry date. For example, with the days, 58 days, and then if there's anything else that you booked, 16 days. But if you've not enrolled in any courses, then you won't see anything. That means that you will have to purchase. And then here, if there is a referral that you've done, we do referrals. So if you have referred any of your junior doctors or your colleagues, then you will get some sort of an amount here, which you can utilize uh, after emailing to us. If you have mocks uh, which have been scheduled, you will see them here. Uh, this feature will be activated in, in February or March. Further down, if you go down, anything that we have, uh, any sort of news, we will, be uh, we will be making sure that you get to know via the notification center. As you can see here, the next batch which we will be starting is on the 17th and the notification is here for all registered users. Additionally, there is a practice session which is going to happen on the 21st December. This is also mentioned. If you go on to, your, uh, go on to my enrollments, you'll see uh, that there are the courses which you can start if you've already registered and then once you start for example let's start this course and you can see here that there are books there are course content which has the audio as well as the material and then there are you can also pause the course and additionally what we have now is that you can join directly from the website our zoom classes which are on the zoom platform we have integrated with our website which you can directly join via clicking on this link on the website. Furthermore, updates will happen where you will be able to join via the application as well um, on the Android version as well as iOS. This is the coach batch history that it will show you that uh, which batch started when um, and this is the further extra uh, the new batches that are going to happen later so now as you can see here on this right hand side course information this will be your history where which batch you joined which batch you have enrolled uh, enrolled previously and then which you are going to enroll you can also choose that and all the information will be here you can attend twice online as well as twice in person so all this you will know from here at the uh, by just clicking on the the full course uh, enrollment once you go into the books you will see that we have the volume one and volume two you just have to take few it will take few seconds for the books to load up here you can see that you can read it without scrolling down as such you won't need to zoom in at all so you can just go in if you click on the next um, here, the page, and then you can go further down, you can even go to a particular page that you want to go into. For example, let's say I press 200 and I press enter, it will bring you down directly to that page. Thereafter, we have news, we update also the new stations which have come and we will up, uh, we upload them in our course material dashboard. 
as you can see this is the latest updated material and we have further updates as well which we have put on the notice board in the academy and we will be updating on our website as well and this is a prescription which is one of the most common questions asked in the exam now going back to the course as you can see here there's 77 files so these are the videos of the full PLAB 2 course, including medicine, surgery, gynecology, psychiatry, pediatrics, ethics, counseling, examinations, and PLAB 2 updates as well. And here you can click on the play button and it will start the video. Now going back to the course again, let's say you have booked your exam and then for unforeseen circumstances you've had to cancel your exam or rebook it again then you can pause the course and then you can once you've got your exam date you can restart it again if you have any problems or anything then you can also um, contact us and we will try and help you out to make sure that you know everything works smoothly for you the email address is here info at aspiretoplab.com um, and we will support you, we'll help you out via the email. Thank you very much. I hope this has helped. If you have further information, if you need further information, please don't hesitate to contact.